right back. Hi, my name is Lindsay and welcome to my mother <laughs> cooking show. Today, we are gonna be making shaved Brussels sprouts with lemon, lemon pepper, and grilled chicken on top. It's amazing, it takes 20 minutes, and it's so healthy for you. So, let's get started. Ingredients you will need are Brussels sprouts, these guys, we're gonna chop them up and shave them. Um, chicken tenders, I usually buy them in the like boneless, skinless breast form, just because it's easier to dice them up, cube them, and then toss them into a skillet. Onion, this is, Optional. I'm obsessed with onions, so that's why I added the onion. Um, fresh lemons. You can organic, non-organic, entirely up to you. And ghee. It's the only cooking fat that I will use. Basically, it's clarified butter. So when you think about how butter is churned, um, there's a lot of heavy cream in it, which is what causes you to have high cholesterol and is bad for your arteries and so on. So ghee goes through the process of eliminating the cream. It rises to the top and they kind of scoop it off. And lemon pepper seasoning, which I get from Central Market. You can go into the bulk section and where normally if you go into the spice section, you buy a jar of seasoning and it's like $6. This I paid 99 cents for in the bulk section. So that's a little hack to get your spices in the bulk section. Let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna need Three squirts of grenadine in it. Woo! You're good. Did Roxy not scratch on the Roxy, you smell! these lovely sliced Brussels sprouts. Then take half a lemon, squeeze, squeeze that bad boy on there. Hey bud, if you hear heavy breathing, that's just buddy. Don't be alarmed. Um, probably do one whole lemon, so two halves of a lemon. So now the brussels are ready to be sauteed. Let's take a look at this chicken. Okay, so I like to season my chicken before it goes into the skillet. It just makes my life a little bit easier. So I'm gonna take a pinch, maybe like two pinches. Pinch of lemon pepper. Like get it all lemon peppery. Um, make sure you wash your hands after you touch the chicken because salmonella is a real problem. There is nothing in there for you, buddy. Then we are going to take a little bit of pepper and a tad bit of salt. I am very superstitious, so I always throw it over my shoulder. So let's get to cooking. Okay, so we are gonna start by putting one spoonful of ghee into each pan. Ta da!
in this kitchen and with every meal, we like the wine. Lewis Winery, it's a Texas wine. Um, High Plains 2015, it's a rosé. So we're gonna be having this with dinner. But where I come from, you gotta drink when you cook. So let's open this bad boy up. you didn't hear that nod of approval it's really really delicious again here is the front of the bottle So now that we've made the dish, it's time for the taste test. I have three willing and able bodies who are here with me today who you will get to hear from firsthand what they think of this delicious and healthy snack slash weeknight dinner option. Let's take it to the jury. Okay, you guys. You don't want to. All right, this is the taste test. Keith Galloway, what do you think, man? Mmm. That is delicious. Get up in there. <laughs> mm. Get all yeah. Oh my god. Okay, alright. Oh my god, it's so good. Did you try it? You haven't tried it yet. It's very healthy. It's almost cauliflowery. Yes, it's very hearty. You get it on the middle of the plate, I guess. Dun dun. Dun dun, dun dun. Look at how beautiful and delicious and yummy and all of the above that is. So thank you for hanging out with us this evening and cooking. This is gonna be a series I will continue on my channel. Um, just quick, easy food that's healthy. Let's be honest, this was like an hour recipe because I'm the world's slowest chopper. But I'm sure you guys at home can cut and chop much more quickly. Um, again, thanks for hanging out, and we'll see you next time. Bye. weird because it's a GoPro and it like is round. Yeah. But that's okay. Are you ready? Hello. Nope. I don't want to do that. Uh, What's in the bag? I got stuff for the third recipe. What, do you, what are we making? Why well, didn't you already do another one? Yeah, but I didn't even send you the ingredients. So I'm what did you buy? But I picked it up. I picked it up.